What's up, guys, and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. If you're enjoying this series so far, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you haven't already. It would be greatly appreciated. I saw an overwhelming amount of support on episode one, and I was talking to chat about this on stream the other day. It does sort of seem like it's always the games that I expect to do the worst that end up performing the best, which is strange to me. But hey, I'm not complaining. I'm glad you guys are enjoying this one so far. So, we've got most of our shelves completely stocked, or as, as stocked as we can get them right now. So we're just ready for the day, straight up. We just gotta check a bunch of people out and uh, try to make some more money so we can expand our empire. That's the goal for today. I want more shelves. Ideally, I'd love more space in here because we are already sort of running out of that. But more shelves, our one objective right now is to purchase a shelf or a refrigerator. So that's that's what we're going to be working on today. What's going on, ma'am? Your hair's doing some stuff. All right. All right. It's not sure if you're a brunette today or if you're a, a redhead. Exact change. Thank you so much. Have a, have a great rest of your day. You're also walking kind of funny. Anyways, how's it going, ma'am? You having a good day? Good. Good, good, good. Getting stocked up on some groceries. 25, 25. Just cheese. <laughs> My man. That's me. That's me when I go to the grocery store. I'm, I'm only there for the cheese and then I'm dipping. And this lady too. Definitely a cheese appreciator. Mad respect. 16. Actually, it was mentioned in episode one that if it's a double zero at the end, I don't have to input anything. So I'm going to try that. 16 flat. It works. Sweet. I'm into it. And exact change. Thank you so much, ma'am. Got another person really stocking up today. Exact change. Perfect. All right. Coffee and cheese. Again, my man. Though I'm not a coffee fan. So I should be able to just do 0.5, right? I don't need another zero. Beautiful. Beautiful. That saves a little bit of time. There's actually been a slight patch since the previous episode. This used to not be a decimal. It actually used to be a comma. So I'm I'm very glad that they've addressed that because I'll be honest, it, it was kind of bugging me a little bit. Maybe some of you noticed that as well. 2675. Thanks, ma'am. Have a good one. Got milk and cheese for you, sir. And your change is 13. Fitty. Easy dub. All right. Got a whole bunch of stuff for this guy. Fitty cents. Again, super easy. I like it. And, oh my, $100. The, your bill was 16 sir, but okay, you do you. That's fine. 83 and 50 Next. Got two cartons of eggs, two loaves of bread. It's going to be 32 even. Thanks, ma'am. Have a good one. Okay, let's try to get some of these shelves restocked if we can. We're not really running low on much. I wonder if I had a functioning 10 key on my keyboard still. I wonder if I'd be able to use that to input the total. That would be really nice. I'm, I'm not going to use like my regular old number pad, the one across the top of the keyboard. That, that would take too much time. We've definitely got several fellow cheese enthusiasts here in town. It's been difficult for me to even keep that stuff stocked. This lady also a fellow cheese enjoyer. Exact change. Thanks, ma'am. Have a good one. And just like that, I think that's our day pretty much over. Dude, 596 bucks? That's insane. Okay, let's try to stock some more tea if we can. It looks like that's all we can really do there. That's a big pile. I wonder if they made the box smaller or something. I don't remember it being stacked that high before. Try to restock some of our coffee beans, too. Are they full bean or are they grounds? That is a full bean right there. We love it. And then eggsma. Got one more going on the shelf. Trying to just use up as much stuff as we can before we place a new order. There we go. Another empty box. And then what's our last one? Oh, the tea. Duh. Okay. So we need more flour. Cereal. Maybe some more bread. Olive oil. Pasta. And then, what did we have up here? Oh, bottled water. 
Right. Okay, well, let's start our order for the morning so we can just get that knocked out. Looks like we've hit our max order limit of just 10 items per day. So we got to sort of keep that in the back of our mind. But $167. So now that we know that, let's go to furniture. And I would kind of like fridge B. Wait, could we sell? Could we sell old stuff? Like if this refrigerator were empty, could I pick it up and sell it somewhere? Maybe that's where the storage comes into play. Either that or it's just for, like, overstocking items, potentially. I guess we'll find out in due time. But I think I'm going to go with Fridge A, because Fridge B is 375 Which is, oh, very expensive. Right. So let's do one less flower. And then maybe now we'll be able to add the furniture. There we go. Total $361. We'll have 234 remaining. But, of course, we can't actually purchase that just yet. We gotta sleep on the dang floor. Products not found three. I'm guessing that's just because we ran out of, like, bottled water, I think, midday. Rent was 20 bones. Bills were 14. I did forget to pay those. But again, it will sort of do that automatically, even if we forget. All right, eggs have gone up, and cereal has gone up as well. Let's quickly adjust our prices. We can get $7.18 out of them. So let's just do... Well, we had it at $6 before, so let's just do 7 Seven on the nose, that works for me. And then what else? It was eczema? Oh, only a $36 increase. So let's do five twenty-five just to keep the math a bit nicer in our head. You know what I'm saying? Cool. Uh, and then let's place our order, and we'll get all of our shelves stocked up. Go ahead and flip our sign around. Any minute now, the customers are going to be lining up because we are open. Sir, could I interest you in some groceries today? No? Okay, that's fine. Like I said, any minute now. Our next objective is to, hello ma'am, purchase a new section using the computer to expand the store. I am all about it. Exact change. Thanks ma'am. How we doing today, sir? Good deal. Good to hear. Cash, you need one, two, three, and four, and 50 cents. Thanks so much. Got quite a bit of people in here. Jeez, yeah. My man. There we go, $3.50 for you. And another. These people, they get me. They just get me, dude. Good afternoon, sir. Got some pasta and some sugar. Gonna make that classic sugar pasta, no doubt. There you are. There's your change. 975. What's going on, brother man? You're really stocking up today, huh? Cash? Uh, that's going to be 55625. Thanks so much. Another cheese enthusiast on card. That's going to be 4650. Dunzo. And you, ma'am. Got some more out of cash. Exact change. Beautiful. This lady just here for the pasta. Sounds good. Exact change. Dude, we are killing it today. Already $549. Just chilling in the back pocket, dude. Here we go. $36.50 for you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. This dude took all of our milk. Okay, never mind. It's just two. He was also grabbing water bottles. My bad. My bad, sir. $17.50. Ma'am, how we doing? Some cheese, some pasta, some eggs, ma. Oh, you gave me cash. My bad. Uh, one seventy-five for ya. There we are. Seven p.m. We've got about two hours left in the day. Things are heating up, though, dude. Ooh, we got a not so great number up there in the top right, but that's okay. It's it's gonna change. This guy is gonna fix that for us, right, sir? Those eyes staring, piercing into my soul. Anyways, sorry. Not trying to waste any time, I promise. 40 bones. Thank you, sir. Under 10 minutes remaining of being open today. We've got this last guy, probably. He might be it. Yep, it is officially 9 p.m. All right, so let's check our shelves. 
see what we've got. We've got a little bit more bread that we can probably restock really quickly. Oh, hey, ma'am. Just swinging on in casually after hours. And this guy, too. That's fine. You know what? Technically, the sign is still open, so I'm not mad about it. Also, I could I could use your money. Just saying. 45. You would. You would. <laughs> you would. There we go. 45.50. We're going to need some more flour for sure. Sugar, maybe. Pasta, definitely. Olive oil, maybe. Uh, bread and cereal are probably fine. Definitely more coffee beans. More water. And cheese, for sure, dude. Cheese is hot. We're going to be looking at 176.66 for all that stuff. But I'm kind of curious under management. I think under growth. It's only 350. Let's do that right meow. There we go. Wow, that was a big change. Oh, it expanded that direction. I've got you. Okay, so we just need to move our shelves and our refrigerators back a little bit. And I think we'll be chilling. Let's see how we did on day eight. Products not found zero. That's perfect. Okay, we've got a couple more store points as well. We didn't really profit whatsoever, which is interesting. But that's okay. Today for sure. Today for sure. Ooh, sugar's gone up and cereal has gone up again. 766. So let's do 750 is probably fine. And the sugar, market price 509. We'll just do five even. Works for me. Okay, I'm going to get these shelves moved really quick. Look at that, dude. Look at that. We've got so much more room in here for activities now. We could even get like a second uh, cash register, though we would probably want a cashier prior to doing that. Uh, but we're looking at 179.08 for this purchase. So we'll make it and we'll get our shelves stocked. We are looking good. The only thing I feel like we should have maybe restocked as well is our milk. That's probably not going to last very long. But before we open things up for the day, I want to check out our bills. Oh, okay. So we can just... But we could also pay other bills early. Why wouldn't we do that? Let's pay tomorrow's rent as well. And we'll pay tomorrow's set of bills. That works for me. Hiring. Oh, level 10. Okay, we got a ways to go there. Storage is still locked. It's going to cost us $1,000. And customization, still nothing there. Yet. It's it's definitely coming. It, it said so. And now we wait. But we won't have to wait long because we've already got our first customer for the day. Dude, I need this game to get spicier somehow. We need like robberies or, or something of that nature. You know, something to keep us on our toes. Keep us on edge. How's it going, ma'am? Got some bread, some tea today. Sounds good. Here's 50 cents back. Got a businessman in his suit. 50 cents for you. Already up to 200 bones for the day. How we doing, sir? You having a good one? Good. Good, good, good. Two doll hairs. Thank you so much. Hey, tell your friends. Please. Our business is dying. <laughs> no, it's, it's not. We're actually doing really good. 550 for you. Both of these dudes are stocking up. Yeah, these are going to be some pretty big orders. That's what we need right about now. 39 even, sir. And you, same thing. A whole bunch of stuff. 36 even for you. I really do need to start, like, trying to stock stuff anytime we have a little bit of downtime. Two cartons of eggs. Two things of tea. Okay, out of 100, huh? You know, your bill was $22. Anyways, just do with that information what you will. 78 on the nose. Just a bottle of olive oil. It was 450. Okay. It's fine. Everything's fine. I should have done another 20. Uh, you know what? We can put that back. There we go. 5 and 50. There you are, ma'am. Enjoy your day. Next time, get smaller bills, please. Or like use a card like everyone else. 2875 for you, sir. Hey, how we doing? Got two bottles of water, two things of tea, 17 even. Ma'am, just need some pasta. Two bones. How's it going? Stocking up, I see. Good. 
Thank you, uh, thank you for your business. And we've got two things of flour for you. Seven dollars fifty. Sweet. Okay. Let's try to stock some more shelves. Cheese isn't actually running as low as it usually is. Maybe all the fellow cheese enthusiasts skipped town. They're going to some cheese conference, probably in Wisconsin or something. Let's put that back down. We need some more pasta. Beautiful. Oh, the door's in a different spot slightly now. That's kind of weird. Oh, no, it's not either. It's just because our, our shelves are moved around now. How's it going, ma'am? Just a bottle of water for you. Two seventy-five. Thank you so much. Got a little bit more from this guy. Twenty-seven. Wow, that's a that's a big price tag for not very many items. Fifty-six whole dollars. Thank you. That puts us up to. She has a tattoo. All right. Cool. That's the first time I've noticed that. 50 cents. Thank you, sir. Yeah, we need some we need some danger. We need something here. Also, we might need more lights. Can we move these? That's big, dude. That's big. Let's move that over there a little bit and then we'll do the same thing with this one probably. A grid would be nice, too. Like a, a grid that we could sort of snap this stuff into. Not the not the boxes, but just like the shelves, the refrigerators, the lights. Even the, the cash register and stuff like that. It would be helpful. Got less than five minutes left in our day today. This is probably going to be our last customer. Maybe one more. Nope, he's just going to keep on walking. But our, our milk definitely didn't last. I, I didn't think it would, so I'm going to try to make sure... Oh, no, look who's back. I'm going to try to make sure to remember to get some more of that coming. Ma'am, do you see the you see the guy behind you, right? I'm not crazy. He's, he's in here? For real, for real? Okay. Hey, sir, how's it going? I'm just kind of worried that you're maybe going to wipe my memory or something. $18 for you. Thank you. Bye. And then we have two more people. And that'll hopefully be it for the day. $36.25. Another $100. So that's 70 We need 75 Gotcha. I think we did okay today. But yeah, some of these shelves are looking pretty sparse. What the heck did we even have here? Coffee, pasta, flour, a little bit of sugar, cereal. Bread is probably fine, but milk for sure. Definitely more cheese, more eczema, more water. Let's get after it. Time to finish out day nine. Products not found one. I don't remember what product that would have been. Probably milk though, if I had to guess. And we made $532 worth of profit today. That is beautiful. Okay, oil has gone down and so has our coffee that we haven't purchased yet, but we're about to. Let's go ahead and do that first. We'll be left with $626. There we are. Oh, and when we purchase stuff, we actually get some store points for that. Nice. You know, I think I'm going to place another small order this morning before we even open. So we need more coffee, more pasta, and more flour. Shoot, dude. I genuinely don't remember which item's prices just went down. Was it coffee? Oh, wait, we can check this. Uh, we just need to look for the red arrow. Yeah, coffee and olive oil. Okay, so let's check that out. We had it for 450. It's now 435. I mean, they'd probably still buy it, but let's let's go down to like 425. I think that's probably fair. And then coffee, we had it 12. It's now 11. Yikes. That's a whole dollar now that we're missing out on, but it's going to be okay. So, let's get our sign flipped around and we are ready for the day. Still got $552 in the back pocket. We're sitting pretty good right now. Was there just a car accident out here? No, they're just piling up. Dude, this, uh, Passat? Passat, I think. Maybe? Really slammed on their brakes hard, though. And then that's probably supposed to be a, a Golf or a GTI, something like that. Whatever you do, don't walk down the alleys. 
Oh, we've got like a CTSV or something. Kind of neat. Anyways, we've probably got customers in here. There we are. But yeah, those alleys. Man, let me tell you, those alleys, they're a portal. Okay, it's it's got to be a portal. Something demonic is happening back there. Card again, 4350. Thank you, sir. How we doing today? Good, 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 good. 75 cents is your change. Got two more customers in here. Maybe a third and a fourth walking in. You know, I haven't been asking anyone. Paper or plastic? Hopefully paper's good because that seems like that's all we have. 75. $1.75. Ma'am, how we doing? Good. I also really need these people to, like, talk back to me. That would be great. It, it does feel a bit lonely from, from time to time. Five, six, seven, eight, twenty-five for you, sir. Ma'am, how we doing? Getting stocked up. That's going to be a pretty uh, pretty expensive one. Thirty-one fifty exact change. Thanks so much. Oh, looky here. We've got two new faces? I don't remember either one of you. Uh, thank you both for coming in. I guess that one guy that we told to tell his friends, he actually did it. Must have. All right, exact change. Thank you, ma'am. Two gallons of milk and a dollar back. We're kind of running light on bread. I think after I help this lady with her eggs, ma, we'll, uh, we'll tackle that. Just real quick. Bread delivery. Easy. Look at that. And it's immediate. Shipping is immediate. We love that. There we go. Holy order, brother. 5450. That is a big one. That do be a big one. $10 is your change. Thank you so much. We've got another new face. I don't think we've seen you here before either. Out of 100. You're smoking something, dude. Everyone in this town is smoking something when they do this. Drives me nuts. Oh my god. We have over a thousand dollars now. That is the first time that we've ever had that amount of money. Dude, that's crazy. Okay, what can we restock though? A little bit of sugar. Let's get rid of that box. Uh, tea. I haven't seen too many people buying. But we've got plenty on standby if, if we do ever need it. Pasta. That lady's going to help us out. Enough so we can throw out that other box. Alright, and lights. Got to get the lights on. How we doing today, ma'am? Got some bread and some tea. There's a dollar back for you. Dude, we just restocked the bread. What the heck going on? 24.25. You know what's funnier than 24? 25. Hey, ma'am, how we doing? Sorry you had to hear that terrible joke. And 75. My brain just stopped working right there. Sorry about that. Okay, yeah, I'm going to try to do this before we actually close for the day. So those two things. What else? Maybe some more flour. And olive oil is fine. Coffee. Coffee for sure. Eczema and milk. That's it. Milk, eczema, cheese. We're actually doing okay on cheese now. Maybe some more water bottles, though. All right. Uh, sorry, guys. I am here to help. Check you out. 38.75. Thanks, sir. This guy, $10.50. And this guy, cash. It's going to be 16 75 just flour. All right. 375. Next. Good size order. Exact change. We love it. All right. Let me uh, start stocking some of this stuff, maybe. While we can. Get our milk down there. Fill that one up. Hang on, sir. I'll be right with you. Give me uh, just a second, please. Try and get all these waters stocked. There we go. All right, one more, one more, one more. Okay, actually, actually, real quick, though, one more shelf. Sorry, guys, sorry. I, I appreciate your patience, your cooperation. It has not gone unnoticed. A dollar. There you go. On card, that's going to be thirteen fifty for you today, sir. Just a loaf of bread, nice and simple. 
16. Three bottles of olive oil and two things of cheese. 25 cents is your change today, ma'am. Okay, what else we got out here? Some more flour. Let's get that going. We do have quite a bit more money now, but I'm still hesitant to purchase fridge B just because I don't know that there's actually anything we can do with our old fridge A's. You know what I'm saying? So I'm I'm thinking maybe we just get two more fridge A's because right now we're only stocking uh, four different items in these two fridges. So we could, going forward, have a dedicated refrigerator for all four of those items. Probably not the worst idea in the world. $559, though. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to buy that in the morning. Let's get our sign switched. And we will finish out the day. Day 10, dude. We're making some good progress here. We profited $320 that day. Not too bad. Okay, milk has gone up, oil has gone up, and eggs have gone down. Used to be $525. Market price is now $466. So let's go $475. Still on the higher end. The eggs do cost a little bit more uh, than the other stuff to to purchase and then what else was it oh let's yeah let's go ahead and get that stuff coming uh, but back to products what else oh oil went up that's right what else went up milk oil and milk so milk is now 230 huh but we were asking three dollars for it before okay 230 let's do 250 i guess sure we're, we're still making a decent amount on that. And then oil is now 453, so we can do 450 easy. Easy, easy. All right, let's unbox our new refrigerators, though. We'll get these things set up. I think this is going to be really nice. Having a dedicated refrigerator for each item, of course, that's probably not going to be great in the long run. Also, I don't have any boxes to be able to move this stuff. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. What we're going to need to make this happen is at least another box of water and another box of milk. That way we can get those two things moved over to their own refrigerator. So let's do that real, real quick. Okay, I think we're ready. Dude, this place is looking nice. Like, real, real nice. I did end up getting an additional, additional uh, cheese and, and thing of eczema. Just that way we'd have all the refrigerators kind of looking a bit more stocked up. Hmm. Sorry, sir, you uh, caught me at a bad time. I was, I was on my break, my water break. Wow, that sounds weird. Hey, it's... Sugar! You guys remember that from the previous episode? I don't even know why I said sugar. Uh, anyways, it was definitely an Oblivion NPC moment. For sure. For sure, for sure. Ma'am, you have... What am I doing? Why? The things that come out of my mouth are just... <sighs> so strange sometimes. Sir, how's it going? Good. Good, 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 good. Like, what was I even going to say to that lady? You have... What? What did she have? Three people in a row with exact change. This place is crazy. Yeah, it might be about time for a midday restock. Flour, coffee, pasta. Fridge looks okay. Wow, this dude's got a lot of stuff. Heckin' right, brother. I am into that. $40.50 for you. Ma'am, having a good day? Good. 24 even. And you? Welcome. Welcome back. What do you have, anyways? We need flour, pasta, coffee. That's it. That's all That's all we need right now. Just a real quick... Whoops. Sorry, guys. Wait. The lights were on? Why do they look so dim? It's almost 8 p.m. now. Still got plenty of customers coming through the door. But I'm going to try to get this stuff restocked as quick as I can. There we go, pasta. Still a little light on the pasta, though. Flour, let's actually start on this shelf first. Because it's... Our box is empty now. 
All right. Sorry, guys. That's my bad. We got some eczema here. 20 50 Dunzo. Thank you, sir. Another cheese enjoyer. Cheese enthusiast. Back from the conference in Wisconsin. On a card. 25 50 Thanks, brother. Have a good one. Another card. $5 50 Thank you. Still nobody trying to steal anything. Got a very, uh, very honest neighborhood, I guess. Hey, it's Sugar. She's back. Dollar seventy-five. Is your change today, Sugar? And then we've got uh, this dude here. Have we seen you before? Kind of look familiar, but I'm not really sure. Thirty dollars seventy-five cents is your change, or your change. That's your your total. He paid with card. Okay, I'm losing it. I'm officially losing it. We're about an hour into this recording. It's it's about time that my marbles start to slip a little bit. What else do we need? More cereal. Bread. I guess we kind of need everything, don't we? Minus tea. We, we really don't need to be buying tea for a while. Refrigerators look pretty solid, though. You having a good day today, sir? Good deal. Four dollars. And whoops. And 50 cents. I almost gave you an extra 50 cents. That would have been my fault entirely. Okay, cereal. Let's get that. Bread, for sure. Olive oil. Definitely going to want some more of that. Coffee beans. What else? Did we get flour already? That should be plenty. Oh, it's already 9 p.m. though. Dang it. Okay, well, we'll have to make that purchase in the morning. But we are, we are ready for another day, ladies and gents. I believe that's all the customers that we're going to have tonight. What a successful day. Let's see how we did for day 11. Products not found, zero. That's all good. Short change, zero. Products found expensive, zero. Dude, we're doing really, really good here. We made $100. We made $100 profit. Not great, but it's not bad. Okay, flour has gone down. Oil has gone down. Sugar and pasta have gone up. So that is $325 now. And sugar, six dollars, six whole bones. Don't tempt me with a good time. And then what the heck went down? Why can't I ever remember this? You know what? Let's get the, let's get the next order coming in. So red arrow, flour and olive oil have gone down. That is now four seventeen. So let's go four twenty five. People will probably still be willing to do that. And then flour is three dollars on the nose, or can be three dollars on the nose. That should work out just fine. Time to stock some shelves, ladies and gents. As for our refrigerators, yeah, we could we could probably do with another order. Maybe just one more thing of milk, one water, one eczema. Had to get an extra box of cheese for all the cheese enjoyers in town. There we go. Okay, that should be more than enough. So what I what I want to do later on or going forward is basically the same thing that we've done now with our refrigerators where we have one specific item per refrigerator. I want to have one specific item per like maybe four shelves. You know what I'm saying? So like this one would all be cereal. This one would all be bread and so on and so forth. But we're going to need... What, at least four, maybe six more shelves to do that? Or wait, one shelf is like, is double-sided. So we'd actually only need, what, two more shelves? Hey, how's it going, ma'am? I will be checking you out today. I, the, your, your, gro your, your groceries is, is what I meant. Exact change. Thanks so much. Have a good one. That, that's the, that's the one with the, with the tat. Yeah, that's the one with the tattoo. But like, where are the robbers at? You know what I mean? Normally, I wouldn't ask to be robbed, but I just, I need something else to happen here. I'm doing the same things every day, day in, day out. It's, get, it's getting old, really. You're going to be that guy. You're going to be that guy today, giving me a $100 bill for something that costs $8, $9 if we're rounding up. Anyways, let's count some change. 91 25. Thank you. Have a good one. Ooh, this dude, this dude's stocking up. 33.25. That's actually less than I expected. Good lord. Okay, this is a big one. And we've 
kind of got a line forming. I was very laser focused on just trying to get everything restocked. There we go. But everything's going well, I would say, for the most part. 225 for you today, ma'am. Thank you so much. Just some coffee beans. That's going to be $11. I know, pretty pricey. But it's the good stuff, I promise. Straight from, uh, I don't know, wherever coffee beans come from. Don't the Oompa Loompas do that? Or they used to before before Willy, uh, before old Willy found them? How's it going, ma'am? Good to see you again. Re okay, yeah. Uh, we were kind of getting along pretty well before, uh, until now. I think after we help these two people, I'm going to try to make a quick... Quick midday delivery, and by midday I mean end of day, but within the time frame where we're still able to actually do that. So we need pasta, olive oil, cereal. Let's just let's just start clicking on stuff. Pasta, olive oil, cereal, got it. What else? Coffee, for sure. And then everything that we have in the refrigerated section at the moment. That stuff is selling like hotcakes. For real, for real. So eczema. Bottled water, cheese, milk. We'll get another tea also. Just tack that on there. 270. Oh, it's already nine. Dang it, dude. I thought I thought we were on pace to be able to to be able to do that today. $25. Thank you so much. Buying all of our cheese from us. Exact change. Thank you. Card eleven twenty-five. Got it. Trying to get as, as fast as I can through scanning all this stuff. 30, 50. And that is probably our last customer of the day. So let's swap our sign around. And I think that's probably where we're going to wind things down at for today. But once again, if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like, leave a comment, help support the dream by smashing that subscribe button. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Peace.